Christmas been off for about six hours. It's freezing out here. Cold inside. <laughs> We've got to eat. So this question is still coming up a lot from, from new agents that I talk to all the time. So we're going to talk about that coming up. Hey, thanks for hanging out with me today. Hey, if you're a new agent or just thinking about getting into the real estate business, you may want to hit that subscribe button down below because I talk about real estate every week. Now this week we're talking obviously about new real estate agents that get licensed and then they come into the real estate business and they wonder, what the heck do I do now? So most of these new agents, they come from, you know, the industries where they're either, you know, they're paid hourly or they're on some type of salary. So coming into a, a, a commissioned, strictly commissioned based uh, industry is totally different and they have to figure out how to produce income and produce it quickly. Now, most of you, if you're subscribed to my channel, you know I talk about video. To me, video is still the number one way to produce leads and they keep producing as long as you're putting them on on youtube you know you got the google search and everything like that they're going to keep producing years and years later i mean i get clients all the time uh, th that call me or email me or text me or uh, send me messages on social media and i always ask them well how'd you find me and, and they always mention some videos i did and they mentioned particular videos that i did probably three years ago but i also understand that video is not for everyone so today we're going to talk about another way to produce leads without going out there and have and paying for a company hundreds sometimes thousands of dollars a month to get you leads and this is also going to create your own business not getting business from your brokerage and then splitting those commissions with your brokerage i know i was set up that way before and i was on a 50 50 split with that brokerage and man it cost me a lot of money until i figured out hey i'm on social media so why not use social media ads and i've been doing social media ads for a while now and by no means am i a guru or anything like that now i know i watch a lot of youtube videos of other gurus that i've learned from and i'll put some links down below or actually here's here's a couple that i a couple of guys that i watch right here uh, really gave me some good insight on these ads how to run facebook ads and be creative in doing so that that way you attract these buyers and sellers. So first of all, if you're going to do Facebook ads, you need to have a business account. So if you don't have a business account profile uh, and you have a personal profile, you can create one from that profile. So that's the first thing. I'm not going to get into that today, uh, but you need to produce that business account. I'm not going to get into all the specifics of the Facebook ads. We can save that for a, another video, or you can go watch one of those guys right there because they, they're the gurus. I'm not but I do some simple ads. I'm gonna do some screenshots right here. So this is just a, a current ad that I'm running right now. As you can see, I started this one on February the 15th and today is just now February the 18th. And so I have, I have it set up uh, for a campaign. I think on this one, particular one, I've, you know, I've set it up for a $25 lifetime spend. Uh, right now I have spent $5.14 on this one and I have seven leads on this one. So that averages out about 73 cents per lead. And you've probably already been out there shopping for leads and what people pay for these leads and it's freaking crazy. So 73 cents is not a lot. Now this is not always the norm, 73 cents. Uh, I have another ad campaign as you can see right here that I'm running right now, uh, producing a lot more leads on this one. Uh, but I'm spending a little bit more money. It's been running a little bit longer and I am at, you know, over $2 per leads, but still to me, that's way better than splitting a, a commission, you know, a $10,000 commission with, with my brokerage, you know, 50, 50 and giving up five grand. I mean, if I put five grand into Facebook ads, I can probably run Facebook ads all year long, just on that money alone. And then that produces income directly to me i keep more of my commissions and that's why i'm telling you this keep more of your commissions keep more money in your pocket i mean we can spend a lot of money. we spend a lot of money as real estate agents on different things you know not just your your classes but your mls i mean there's there's all kinds of uh, money that we put out there every month and there's no need to go out there and spend a lot of money on these leads when 
you can do it yourself. Now again, it's not the easiest thing to do, but go watch a few videos here on YouTube. Go check it out. It's actually with the Facebook, it'll, it kind of walks you through the whole process and you kind of, you have to play around with it for a little while. You have to see what really works and what doesn't work. Uh, I just checked and we have more <laughs> leads coming in on this particular campaign. So, you know, for 25 bucks, I think that's a great investment to spend a few hours on YouTube in the evening after hours learning how to set up these Facebook campaigns. Hey, if you want a little help, like I said, I'm not a guru, but I'm more than willing to help. Send me a message down below. Maybe we could hop on a Zoom or something like that. And I'll walk you through what I've actually done here to set up my campaigns and to produce these types of leads. Uh, it's not always gonna work out every single time, but sometimes, you know, I actually set them up. I watch them very closely. If they're producing, I keep running them. If they're not, I shut them down, make some changes, readjust and put them back out there. Hey, don't forget to check out these videos right here. I appreciate you watching this channel. Hit that subscribe button and I'll see you next time.